What's up everybody, I'm Pastor Chris and this is your CL Moment. Today, real quick, I wanna talk to you about disagreeing yet loving one another. You know, Pastor Cameron was uh, doing a message a few weeks ago and you can totally go check that message out. Click that anode right at the top of the screen or at the bottom, wherever it may be. Anyways, uh, in that message, he gave an example of making uh, grits, right? And then he was like, and grits are only made to be used with cheese. Like you're only supposed to add cheese in there, which I agree. But anyways, moving on. A lot of people are like, no sugar, no cheese, no, just salt, like all these things. People were laughing, people were in the chat typing which one their favorite was, and guess what? Everyone laughed and had a good talk and conversation. So why is it when it comes to food, and you like olives and I don't, or some people like steak sauce on their steak and I don't, but I can still respect that person, love that person, and continue to be friends with that person. Uh, when it comes to sports even, right? Go Cowboys, I think they're the best team. However, lots of people think differently, uh, but that doesn't mean that we're not friends and we can't still talk shop and talk about sports and different things like that. I don't say, oh, you're a Redskins fan, we're, we can't hang out or anything like that. But why is it we can have conversations and still be friends with people when it comes to simple things like that, food, uh, sports, uh, even like talk show hosts or, what, or TV shows and movies and different things like that. But when it comes to politics, we see that people just completely divide and it's like, oh, you're voting for this person or you vote for this party or this party, we can't be friends anymore. Well, I'm here to tell you that's not what the Bible says. The Bible tells us to love one another. Doesn't matter your political stance, doesn't matter what sports team you like, God has said for us to love one another. So this is just an encouragement, okay? As we're coming into November, elections coming up and everything like that, this year, Try to have just conversations with, with one another. And if you disagree, let that be okay. Still love them. Still love them for who they are. Because what they believe in in politics is not who they are. God looks at their heart. God loves them for them. And he tells us to do the exact same thing. So this is just an encouragement as we're coming into this season again. Guys, listen. Feel free to have conversations. Feel free to talk, but go into those conversations with loving hearts and attitudes and know that at the end of the day that you can still love that person. No matter who they're voting for or what they're believing in in that situation, we just need to do what the Bible says and love one another. I'm Pastor Chris. Don't forget to go check out that message and we'll see you next time.